Hey, my name is not Sven. It is Martin. Yeah. Hey, so I'm watching the footage from the what they call it. I mean, the soccer catastrophe happening in Egypt tonight, where 74 people right now are confirmed dead after um, a game in the highest soccer league between Al Masri that beat uh, the top team Al Hali, which was a big, big upset. And what happens is that supporters of the winning team storm the field and starts attacking players, starts attacking security, and 74 people are confirmed dead after being knifed down, the stadium is set on fire, people are being stomped to death, and you're just looking at it and it's like, there's no logic at all. I mean, why, if, if, you're, if your team, which is sort of a sucky team, beats like the best team, why would you then storm the field and do this? It's just, it just that doesn't make sense. I mean, there's gotta be something, something else, because otherwise people will, people are extremely stupid. Because if, if you win a game like that, you should be the happiest person alive. And instead, this is totally overshadowed and all the, the coming games in the Egyptian League are now being postponed, uh, waiting to clear this out. And at the same time, apparently there's another, um, there's something else happening at, at a different arena at the same time. I mean, we, we do know that the, this, you know, the situation in Egypt, although people are talking about it, it's been one year since they were liberated. Well, they changed government into a military instead so there's got there's bound to be something underlying but this is just insane doesn't belong on a football field or a soccer field and hopefully hopefully it will stop at 74 uh, but people well I guess we're yet to be confirmed of what the total uh, toll will be but uh, whoa